In this video, I'll show you how to populate a drop down list with unique distinct list, unique distinct values sorted from A to Z. And here is the formula, array formula that returns the values. And there is already a video about this formula, and I'll put a link in the description below. But I want to show you how to build a, a formula that extracts these values. And to do that, I'm going to use, I'm going to type the equal sign. And then a cell reference to to this value, the first value, and then lock that, uh, and you do that with function key f4, and you can see the dollar characters here, dollar signs, and that means that it it is locked, and then. Uh, colon index function d1 and I'm going to use d1000 d1000 and you may have to change that depending on how many values you may get and then the lookup function And the first argument is 2, and then 1 divided by an array, and that array is going to be the same as this cell reference here. And I want to know if it's not equal to. Uh, blank and the last argument is the row function and a cell reference to this ending parenthesis and an ending parenthesis for the lookup function and another one for the index function and now enter this as an array formula And then expand that to cells below and then enter it as an array formula once again. And you do that by pressing Ctrl and Shift, press and hold Ctrl and Shift keys and then press Enter. And now the, this formula here extracts only the unique distinct values here. And you can use that formula in a drop down list. So copy it. And I'm going to put the drop down list here. And then go to tab data on the ribbon. Click data validation button. Click list in the drop down list. And then paste the formula. And then click the OK button. And that was not the case. I'm going to use a named range instead. New named range. And then paste the formula here. And yes, it works. And then repeat with the data validation button list and now type the range the named range and then click the OK button and now you have the values 